but the moment i came in the auditorium and i saw 300 people who are mm-hmm. just praying this way and they are going to keep quiet and listen to me so carefully i was mm-hmm. so hesitant to think that maybe i forget when i stand in my viewers perspective that once this video gets uploaded on my channel my viewers feel that they are getting to learn from this conversation and not just english hello hello ma'am uh i forgot your name i had back to back two sessions i forgot your name my so sorry. name is uh, sorry my name is chelsea chelsea yes am chelsea. i saying it correct chelsea. yes yes okay right. okay ma'am i am kavita joining you from mumbai okay that is great and i'm from kerala uh, shall i introduce kerala. myself is it all right yes Yes, 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 okay, yes. So I'm from Kerala. My name is Chelsea, and uh, I did my bachelor's in English and Communicative English in 2021. And right now, I'm doing two certification courses: one in TESOL and other in digital marketing. Yeah, that's about me. One in digital uh, TESOL. marketing and TESOL. What is this all about? Teaching English to other speakers. I'm taking a training okay. course, certification course okay. for that. Okay, yeah. okay. I I was unaware that this kind of courses are also available in India yeah, there is, for there teaching is. English to other students. Yes, yes. Other okay. speakers, you know. Yeah. Other speakers. Okay. Yes. Speakers means not students, but uh, somebody who is going to train the students. No, no, no. Somebody who is from other country. Other country. Okay. Yes. Okay. So, wh- which kind of country are we comfortable in teaching with, like Indian? No, no, no. Maybe, maybe it's Germany or something of that sort. Their native language might not okay. be English. All right. Uh, uh, suppose uh, people who are from a- Arabian side, you know, Arabic speaking people. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Arabic. So, okay. Sort, okay. Yeah. Okay. Right. Right. And I'm also freelance. So what about? And you? I am recording this video. I am recording this video for YouTube. So before okay. even beginning, I am taking the permission that please allow me to insert yes. this video on my channel. Yes, yes, of course. Okay. Yes. I work as an academic content writer. I teach chemistry to students, and with that, I have a YouTube channel. And from YouTube channel, I have some students who might teach English. So this is okay. it. And my channel is all about English and communication and personality. So mm-hmm. I have joined Clappingo because I want to review Clappingo in a detailed manner, and I'm trying to book slot with every student for one. and showing it to my viewers that okay this is also a tutor if you want have a look at her and book your slot with her if you wish to so okay. with that perfect time here you're doing a wonderful <laughs> work yeah all right thank you ma'am okay. you thank don't you. you don't hear my voice do tell me okay because i'm not using okay. earphones yeah no no ma'am. it is clear from my end yeah mm-hmm. it is clear from my end no no issue at all that is great okay so today's topic is fame right Same. Okay. Yeah. And do you have any doubts? Any other doubts regarding English? Ah, uh, not doubt, but you know, I come here with a question every time, and I ask every tutor one question from my okay. viewers' perspective. You know, whatever I just give in the comment, I ask that to a tutor, and you know, children are more reliable to what tutor says because they feel yes. that they are trained people and they know the best. instead yes. of listening to somebody else or taking advice from anybody else i also have made many videos regarding english speaking how to practice alone and how to start rectifying your mistakes how to mm-hmm. speak to people but i have a question for you but okay. i don't know whether shu should i begin with that question or should we begin with the topic so it's up to no, you no no it's your choice complete choice tell me <laughs> All right. Okay, so I have a question that there are many students who speak English very well, and even I have come across them that mm-hmm. uh, they speak very wonderful English. I mean, their accent might not be that uh, suitable or crisp to hear, but uh-huh. they speak well. So I have a question now to know that if a person speaks English very mm-hmm. fluent, okay. is it possible that he will have hundred percent best communication if he can speak English? fluently it also depends on how you you know organize thoughts your thoughts how you organize it for example some of the people know how to speak well but they don't know to yeah. organize their thoughts for example suppose okay. what they want to say at the end might be at the beginning they might say it in the beginning so that is also very okay. important organize okay. your thoughts okay yeah. okay so for communication point of view what should a person work for 
like if i have to build in communication within me so people mm-hmm. mostly go towards learning english they think that if we are able to speak english very well communication automatically will be attained but i don't mm-hmm. find this to be true communication is a completely different topic and speaking english is completely different somebody mm-hmm. who can speak english cannot necessarily mm-hmm. be a fluent or a good communicator or an orator for mm-hmm. being a good communicative person what should a person work on only okay. english or something other than that so if no, you no, actually everything depends on confidence you know even if you don't know english some people are very confident that uh, you will feel as a teacher also you will feel sometimes that is it right or wrong you will have that doubt that skepticism right. in yourself yeah right. so right. confidence right. Some, you should carry with you know you yourself till the day you die i would say it will really help you yeah that's what i would so say so communication confidence. communication could be built based on confidence even if you don't know anything pretend that you know everything seem to be confident because and step by step step learn it okay i'm not saying that okay. you uh, can be 100% confident and you shouldn't know any english no but right. confidence right. is an element is a very big element which can build to your you know speaking right. english fluently right all right right yeah. right okay thank you thank you for answering for the okay. question for the tutor i hope <laughs> now we can begin so that i was okay with it right <laughs> Yes, of course you are tutor. I don't know. You know well. You have to be saying that your doubt might have been cleared to some yes. level. Yes, yes. Thank right. you. Right. That is great. Okay, so uh, shall we delve into the topic? Is that all right? Okay. So today's topic is fame, as you know, and mm-hmm. there are two extemporary topics. Okay. So I want you to uh, tell me which one you would go f- for first. Okay. Fame. Fame. You can choose. and just say about one the first one okay. is luck or hard work the second one is well begun is half done so well yeah. begun is half done i would mm-hmm. like to speak on both of them which uh, i will speak everything from my viewers mm-hmm. perspective that once this video gets uploaded on my channel my viewers feel that they are getting to learn from this conversation and not just english Yes, okay, yes. so uh, yes. it's not for you. It is for my viewers. Okay, <laughs> so it might I'm not. <laughs> okay, it might not definitely. be relatable to my life, but it will definitely relate something to which I am going to represent it to my viewers. So uh, I believe that when I began making YouTube mm-hmm. videos in the very beginning, I had begun with no hope that people would even watch me, and my first video went very bad from my mm-hmm. own opinion. It is when I traced back a year back. in 2000 okay. a year uh-huh. back so uh-huh. when i created my first video i thought that i'm not going to make it up because i couldn't edit voice i couldn't make thumbnails i did uh-huh. not know where to select background from i was unaware of everything so i uploaded so uh-huh. i would not say that i had begun very well yeah. for my for my case i did not begin well uh-huh. but now when i say see that and i trace back to that journey from the very first video turning uh-huh. off fans sweating all the time wiping off the sweat and again uh, recording the video so it was bit difficult in the in the beginning when i did not know what to make how mm-hmm. to represent myself and what kind of people will gain my attention so mm-hmm. i was unsure of it but i began so not mm-hmm. even well begun but i began so i i found that this is a brave step for a person even if you don't begin well don't mm-hmm. consider that have i started it in a correct manner or am i doing it in a wrong way many people would come and criticize and say that you did not do well you could have done this better that better i don't know what all shit but mm-hmm. they themselves haven't done anything but there will yeah. be 100 people to advise you that don't start with this they'll mm-hmm. try to break you in the beginning so don't listen to anybody simply yeah. start what you feel and eventually you will own by your own realize that no i should have done this way to modify my video in this manner so i'm just talking about my own opinion my videos uh, viewers can take it as they are english mm-hmm. okay wherever they start from many people think that i don't have environment i don't have this and that so mm-hmm. all these barriers they keep counting for which they never start but mm-hmm. at least you you get some of the other hope here and there at least begin with that you will yes. definitely reach somewhere and not at zero all your life yeah so for gaining at least 2 to 5% at least begin 
so not if if it if you haven't begun it well at least start yeah so yeah that's instead of that has begin so this was your first top second topic which you yes, uh, yes. asked to me and uh, beginning with uh, which was the other one hard work or good luck luck yeah okay i believe luck is not playing a role at all hard work hard work actually is the first thing because for a year now i have been making videos i made 10 videos 20 videos 30 videos and a bit upset about everything that my videos weren't reaching the expectation i expected with every video i felt that okay this should go well this should work well okay nothing worked in the beginning but uh, suddenly i started gaining the reach my videos started reaching to a wide audience i don't know how now there are people who are connecting to me they are looking to my previous videos which i had recorded with a very ugly face being very unconfident they watch those videos and they say that ma'am you look so innocent in this video i said why are you even looking at that face man don't look at that video sometimes i feel i have to delete that because i don't mm. want that to be a memory no, no, see, see, no at least shall i shall i tell you something sorry to interrupt uh, no don't problem. delete it you know because you can always go back and see where you came from you know always you will be right. like ah this was the level and this is the level right right now right. we right. very very good of it oh, yeah yes All this right. is why i am not deleting and many a times when viewers come and say ma'am i am practicing three four months and still i haven't seen any improvement in myself although it is not visible now but it will make sense a year or two years later then somebody in front of you would come and appreciate so yes. for that you will have to begin and clap for yourself in silence and start doing the thing so i don't delete my videos i tell them that you please go and check out my first video you'll be very much confident then <laughs> of course that so they go actually and check it out and they comment me later that i have seen your video and now now i'm going to practice from today onwards i feel confident enough Yeah. So this is the case. I feel luck also plays a role. See, I have been able to reach a wider audience. It is ninety nine percent of my hard work, which yes. nobody saw, and yes. people don't even know how it is recorded and how it is edited and how difficult it is to in fact face camera for a camera shy person in the beginning. And now, mm-hmm. now everything makes sense because this one person luck has also helped me somewhere to cross across some people's eyes. and yeah. they have clicked on my video they have watched me they have appreciated been a part of my family so everything is making sense now so same same i don't consider same as important whatever you do do it with consistency with good persistence that you are going to get something benefit of it and follow your passion the most important thing because if you are not loving the task you are doing definitely you're going to end up doing a crap you are yeah. never going to and even and you will not even enjoy doing the thing i yes, kept yes. on doing because i like creating videos i never thought that okay even if people are not watching me uh maybe when i get old and mm-hmm. i'll see that how i look when i when i was young so <laughs> at least for this purpose i can record the video you know there yes. are times when i got upset that nobody is watching or nobody mm. is commenting of course i received comments in the very beginning some people were so generous to follow my channel lately but <laughs> you, you know sometimes it is like up, right the uh, the people who from your beginning itself were there with uh, yeah with you in this journey yeah right right yes yes there are yeah. a few names which i remember very well their comments mm-hmm. are consistently visible on my each video so popular names in my mind and whenever they write a comment i come to know yeah this was the person who had followed me when i had nothing mm, so yeah. i remember them very well Yeah, I, I am right now getting goosebumps. You know, <laughs> <laughs> I've not done that big enormous thing <laughs> to nothing be so popular because... about. But no, no. As you said, you, know, you have to begin something. You have to start at least. Yeah. Okay. So uh, let me uh, give you a situation. Okay. Suppose there is a person who wants to start a YouTube channel. but doesn't have any confidence and is self doubting himself or herself so what uh, shall that person say might be in your audience itself there might be a person right who knows so what would you like of to course. tell them as a person as an experienced person who has been through these jo- this journey you know i would only say that person don't edit the video just record the video of yourself in english 
you mm-hmm. are doing it for yourself not to impress people do it for yourself not for anybody else if mm-hmm. people follow you they will rectify your mistake they will also help you get ahead with this and they will realize that how much effort you are putting in mm-hmm. so start with it start with it for your own self not for anybody else to be impressed or to create an uh, impact on other person don't do that start for mm-hmm. yourself you know all of us are going to die one day that's the eternal truth harsh reality that we all are rushing towards death so we have a limited period here so for this limited period you do your work as per your wish your expectations not what other people say even if you don't feel confident first video first step is going to be the toughest one i still yes. remember when i went on stage for the very first time in my school when i had 300 audience watching me and i just had to speak up two minutes bible two minutes mm-hmm. bible but the moment i came in the auditorium and i saw 300 people who are mm-hmm. just praying this way and they are going to keep quiet and listen to me so carefully i was mm-hmm. so hesitant to think that maybe i forget when i stand in front of them mm-hmm. although it was just for two minutes but mm-hmm. the courage that time i required was very huge oh, they were shivering by holding the mic thinking that oh my oh my god am i going to make it or am i going to get mm-hmm. get yeah. mistaken in between or am i going to forget but you know i did well i performed well after 2 minutes when i kept my mic i felt mm-hmm. that no if i could take this step i spoke 2 minutes people were all silent they watched me definitely i will do more better than this and i'll next time come again and speak for 5 minutes after that i started participating in school program wow. so mm-hmm. i liked what i did so first step is going to be the toughest you yeah. have to confront first mm, see, yes, yes. see the reality be pressurized inside face of fear only yeah. then you get things done but you know what i was just the opposite i never had this stage fear people call it stage fear yeah okay. but i never had it in my entire life i don't know okay. when i oh, that- my, i feel like you know this is something great and i have to you know uh, put all my effort towards it and a lot of people are watching me so that's the yeah i feel Then happy you are an exceptional person who who has this inborn okay. talent of being extraordinarily open in public all the time then it is and good it my, is good actually my parents were very supportive very supportive okay. that's that okay. the reason okay okay okay